big day here for the LML. As you can see, fully functioning. We got wipers, we got AC going. We got nothing but an engine light currently, and we got a full manual valve body on a 48RE. So this is first test driver. Cable is messed up, so shifting is a little wonky, but we are fully functional. Also, I don't have my lockup buttons hooked up yet. As you can see, it is leaving in first because, like I said, our cable is weird and messed up. So I'm not getting first gear. So this is technically a second gear start, but. Try shifting just because I don't want to mess it up and get a big shift bind. But big day, we got the truck running, the truck is happy, all interior functions, nothing is rewired um, as far as nothing standalone. This is fully intact, um, running full manual valve body, custom console. So back to some more buttoning up, and then we'll release the full video once we get the cable and can actually bang some gears, and we'll go from there. All right, guys, welcome back to the channel. So today we have what I believe may be the world's first LML with a full manual valve body, 48 swap. At this point, it is fully functional. Um, aside from we don't have the front drive shaft in yet due to clearance issues on the aftermarket shaft that was on there. And we got a little bit of wiring to do up on the transfer case. Um, but just going to be a quick overview. Um, just kind of showing the basic functions we got going so far. Um, as far as functionality, the truck is completely functional. Um, we have got all AC working, um, lights, you name it. Everything is working, minus the reverse camera. So currently, we, the only functions lost so far are reverse camera. And um, currently, due to the event we're trying to go to, we're not going to worry about the four-wheel drive. But I'm going to give you a quick walk around. Um, this truck has been a bit of a work in progress for the last couple years a um, couple different setups and things um, but this is probably how it's going to stay for a bit um, I was not aware um, that there actually was none other um, for no other 48 swaps until just recently so I figured I would share with you guys so obviously to start off with we have a shifter mounted here um, custom shifter insert OEM cup holders are utilized um, this cable went bad on us right after install so that's kind of why we're limited on our driving i don't want to try to shift it without um, with the cable messed up i don't want to bind the shifts um, so we're going to leave that there but yeah so fully functional we got wipers we got ac we got lights um abs traction control all that works everything We'll go under the hood real quick. This is also a custom turbo setup that we did. Garrett turbo, um, 14 mil pump. So it should be a pretty fun setup. Almost looks OEM. So hopefully that, um, kind of an interesting thing for the day like i said a couple little things to dial in um new shift cable new longer shift cable should fix our issue there and then um should be out having some fun with it <laughs> 